All right, so let's take a look at the floater. So this is a great tool to use anytime you need to shoot the ball over a bigger defender or a rotating shot blocker. Also, shoot it over somebody that's taking a charge because you ultimately don't want to get an offensive foul running into the man and, and getting an offensive foul. And so it's the big man killer. Let's take a look at it. All right, Ty Ty catches the ball off the catch. Floats it off of two feet and just floats it over the defense. So let's just take a look at it one more time, right? So catches the ball, right? Attacks. He may, he could have hit number 34, right? But he doesn't. Comes off, right? Shot fakes. Gets an advantage. Gets into the paint now, right? And he lands on two. So keys with this, we want to always land on balance with our knees down, with our hips loaded and our chest up towards that rim. We always want to stay on balance, right? And so with this, when you shoot it, you want to shoot it straight up with kind of a soft touch, right? You don't want to follow through, but look how high, look how high the uh, floater is. It's up above that white square. So we just always want to have a high drop angle so that if we, if Ty Ty does miss it, then number 34 is over there to get to get the rebound, offensive rebound, and just put it, get a put back. So here we go. Again, on balance, straight up and down with soft touch right here. Same thing, all right? This is off of an offensive rebound, second chance opportunity. The guard catches it, attacks downhill immediately, right? And, right, you see number 15 here in the paint, right? He's not gonna finish around him, so he finishes over. So staying on balance again with our hips down, our knees bent, right? And just floats it up, no follow through. Like, see how he just pushes, kind of just pushes the ball up in the air for a soft touch floater right here. And all floaters are off too, right? Runners is off one, which we'll take a look at later. So again here, gets the ball off the catch, attacks immediately off the screen, turns the corner here, right? Again, lands on two, making sure that we're, again, we're on balance. Knees is bent, hips down, chest up, and right when he hits the floor, he just floats that ball right up with soft touch again. So no type of follow through whatsoever, pushes the ball up over the defense, over the rotating defender, and just drops it in right here. Takes thousands and thousands of floaters to master and practice for it to be patent. Same thing, just off the ball again, right? Jazane catches the ball in the corner, rips downhill, sees rotating defenders, number two and number 34 clog in the paint, so just floats it over and finishes it, right? You wanna be in the air, just like the same for the same man finish. You want to be in the air before that rotating defender gets in the air. And, and ultimately, like, this is, un this is unguardable. This is the big man killer again. So here, quick hop off two. Again, quick hop off two for balance. Eyes up, hips down, chest up. And just touches that ball up, up and over that defender right here. Again, right? These are all, like, same clips right here. Same thing with big men, right? Big men's in the dunker spot here. Always, always ready to retrieve the ball, receive the ball here. Knees bent, shot ready, hands ready. Quick hop off two feet, staying on his toes, knees bent, hips down, chest up, right? And then floats it high and soft over the defender. 